if you do a film for Disney that you turn into a cartoon character? The men behind the makeup magic are Doug Drexler. Are you ready for the last one? And John Caglione, Jr. The position. Hurry. Two longtime yeah. fans of Chester oh, Gould's distinctive Careful. character Careful. style. Watch it. Every character is an individual, an individual actor, so we had to create individual looks for that specific person. You know, you could look you could look at a lot of comic magazines and, and cartoon strips and faces tend to look the same, but not right. not on Dick Tracy. Doug and John spent four months developing each of Dick Tracy's gangsters before cameras ever rolled. After that, it was the actor's turn, some spending another four months working inside new and not-so-handsome faces, like Ed O'Ross, who plays Itchy, the hitman. The makeup can get really intense. On the other hand, the makeup looks so great. You know, I mean, it's, I mean, it's like... You see these guys coming out, and it's like, no way. You know, it's like, God, you know, because they're so distorted, but yet they, they're, they're so lifelike. It was very funny with these guys who played these parts. I forgot what they looked like. And then when I would see them with their makeup off, they were, I thought, God, they're so good looking, those guys. And when you have it on, you do feel strange. People treat you differently. I mean, there's no doubt about it. You come walking up with his face. Um, you, if, if, if a person doesn't know you, the first thing they see is this, and that's the way they treat you. Actor William Forsythe prepared for his role as Flat Top by spending long, uncomfortable hours in the makeup chair each and every morning, day after day. I have three and a half hours, you know, people putting glue and rubber all over me, so it puts me in a perfect mood, like to play a killer. The makeup artists did the impossible. Those cartoon characters came alive. The ultimate compliment to Doug and John's makeup comes from Jean exactly Gould O'Connell, like. Chester Gould's daughter. Jean literally grew up with her father's mob of gangsters. She says visiting the set of Dick Tracy and coming face to face with Flat Top, Itchy, and all the rest was like a reunion of old friends. It's marvelous watching them because this is their life right now and they're living the part oh if only my father could see this he would be prouder than proud where there's gangsters there's crime okay here we go guys and